The owners of CNW Market and Ice Cream Parlor, Clarence and Wendy Weaver, are not only selling groceries but giving them away, as up to 225 residents are the recipients of their generosity on Saturday mornings. It's not just a store that we're just trying to push a product out, it's the relationship with the folks in the community. Operating for eight years and donating for two. Weaver says the pandemic pushed this initiative. Either we do something different or we would have shut down. Although the owners experienced reduced revenue due to an 85% loss in foot traffic at the start of the pandemic, Weaver says the collaboration with District 65 and the Evanston Community Foundation is what allowed them to supply food for families. Our volunteers and contributors uh, allowed us to be where we are right now. CNW is working to foster new connections and give hope to residents in need. Their efforts have not gone unnoticed by board member Brian Wallace. It becomes a true example of what a community can do to support and help one another. No matter the conditions, Weaver says the team is passionate about providing. Rain, sleep, shine, below zero, uh, or above 100. We haven't had too many turns that we've missed. After registrants cleared curbside pickup bags much faster than usual on Saturday, Weaver says she is concerned that the food insecurity is not going anywhere. If people weren't hungry or really need these groceries, will they really get up at 8 o'clock in the morning? About 12% of residents in Cook County face food insecurity each year. Weaver says she hopes to do more to help. We may be able to provide groceries for maybe two or three meals, but there's other days left in the week. CNW Market has plans to partner up with the Rotary Club to create a permanent pantry accommodating those in immediate need. In Evanston, Caitlin Bender-Thomas, Medill.